Uh, my name is John Sullivan. I'm the executive director here at the Free Software Foundation. And one of my favorite parts of my job is getting to welcome you all here to Libra Planet every year. So thank you all for coming. You're here. You made it. Uh, it's going to be an awesome event. It's going to be awesome because you're here. And I want to just take a quick poll of hands. How many people are here for the first time? Wow. Yeah. That's so awesome to see because that's, that's really one of the main goals of this event. And we, we try to have something for uh, people who are brand new to free software as well as people who have been in it for a while and, and have helped make it get to where it is today. So that's, that's so awesome to see. Is there anybody here that's been to every one? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. <laughs> Joey's giving me a half hand signal. I'm not sure what that means. I think that means almost all of them. Uh, I want to say thanks to our hosts here at MIT, um, especially Professor Sussman and Marisol Diaz uh, for hosting us here and making it possible. You know, MIT is kind of where this all got started, so it's uh, always great when we're able to have the conference here. I do want to flag that there is another event uh, happening right next door to us um, in one of the rooms that we have occasionally used in the past. Uh, so they have a sign outside and they have a desk outside of their room. Just want to flag it so people know and uh, we'll of course be good neighbors. We are also streaming and recording. So hello to everybody watching along at home. Uh, all of our streaming and recording is done using free software. Thanks to our tech team, uh, which we have some people from down front, and also our tech team staff and our honorary staff, uh, David here, who is been uh, helping make this whole streaming system go for a few years now. Recordings after the conference will be posted at media.liberplanet.org, which is our GNU Media Goblin instance. Um, and we document this whole setup for streaming, recording, and publishing on the Libra Planet wiki with the hopes that other conferences um, will also adopt it and start using it. The theme of this year's conference is trailblazing free software. Uh, it's in fact printed on the t-shirt that you will be buying um, right after this session is over. Uh, at the GNU press table outside, I see uh, plenty of them in the audience already. Thanks. And you know, the question we're trying to ask here is, how will free software continue to bring to life new principled technologies and new principled approaches to the world uh, as the technology keeps changing, is changing around us? If we're going to change the world like that, uh, we do really need everybody on board. You know, free software needs to become an issue for uh, everybody at the kitchen table. Um, not just hackers and developers. Uh, and to that end, and to make this a welcome environment for everybody, the conference does have a safe space policy. And that safe space policy covers the conference here, all of the social events, the IRC channels, the mumble server, um, anywhere that's considered an official conference space. Everybody read that policy um, when they registered. Uh, but just to paraphrase the important parts here, um, the Ever Planet is a professional conference, so unwelcome physical activity or unwelcome sexual attention is not acceptable in any of those spaces. Many attendees here are passionate about free software. They enjoy a good debate. Um, however, please do be aware of when other people aren't interested in a conversation any longer or a particular debate and you know, try not to talk over other people. That's not good for the conversation. If someone states that they don't want to talk about a particular topic, respect that person's wishes. Uh, if you um, want to report or need to report a violation of the policy, uh, we have an incident response team. The contact information for us is in the printed program. Uh, you can also always locate one of us by going to the registration desk where you checked in. And you can recognize this by the yellow flags that we have on our badges. Uh, the team this year is uh, me, Molly DeBlanc, uh, Donald Robertson, and uh, Don uh, Bryanson Peterson. Um, Don will also be at the GNU Press table uh, selling you a t-shirt um, for most of the conference. So you can always find us if you need to uh, report or talk about something. Our conference photographer, Maddie, will be uh, taking photos to help show everybody else who's not here what they're missing. If you don't want to be photographed, uh, please pick up a red lanyard from the front desk, from the registration desk. Uh, these lanyards express a preference. Green means photographs are okay. Yellow means please ask. Red means please don't. But of course, in addition to that, uh, as an attendee, please respect the lanyard preferences of other people. Uh, but even if they have a green lanyard, if they say they don't want to be photographed, we'd appreciate it if you would respect that. For maybe the first time ever, I have no schedule changes to announce. So, yeah. 
the schedule is as displayed and the handout that you received at the desk when you checked in. Um, it is also on some signs outside the rooms and uh, we were able once again this year to provide the schedule through Giggity, which is the uh, free app running on Android or Replicant available from the F-Droid uh, app store, free software, and uh, I recommend checking that out. It's a nice way to mark, get, you can mark sessions that you like and it'll remind you about them. Um, and that will be kept up to date as well. Uh, and I'm just, I'm really excited about that program this year. Um, the lineup of speakers we have, I, I feel it truly represents the combination of uh, community, technical, legal, and philosophical knowledge that makes this conference uh, such a unique thing. You know, we, we have elements in all those categories and I think that really you know, represents fully what the free software movement is about. I want to thank all of our speakers for volunteering their time and their expertise in order to make that happen. Uh, I know you'll especially get a lot out of our keynotes. Um, we have Tarek Lubani this morning. Uh, we have Richard Stallman tonight, Fidel Garvey tomorrow morning, and Mickey Metz tomorrow night. Uh, tonight is also the Free Software Awards, so please come and, and help us recognize this year's winners. I want to tell you where they are now because I'm excited, but you'll, you'll have to come. Uh, the evening keynotes might uh, not only give you knowledge and inspiration, but also prizes. So we will be doing raffle drawings um, at the start of the closing keynote tonight and tomorrow night. We will be giving away great prizes like a 3D printer from ALF Objects, uh, routers and vouchers from Vikings and Think Penguin, replicant phones and RYF laptops from Technoethical. Uh, you all received one ticket with your badge. Uh, FSF members can get a second one at the raffle booth where you can also buy more tickets. Um, there will be additional drawings throughout the event for other prizes at the table, uh, at the raffle table next to the Guinea Press table uh, with more prizes from JMP and Aeronaut. Uh, you must be in the keynotes to win those keynote prizes, so don't miss out. And uh, let's give a quick thanks to all of those raffle donors um, for making that possible. Uh, as I mentioned, members get an extra raffle ticket. Uh, how many members do we have here, FSF members? It's also fantastic. Thank you all so much. Uh, it's your memberships, um, in addition to the raffle, that help support our work uh, year-round. Uh, it's... It's, uh, we recently hit a big milestone. We, we reached 5,000 members for the first time in our history. So, yeah, thank you. It's put us uh, a much better place to keep fighting for your freedom. Um, tomorrow, there will be a members' lunch uh, at lunchtime. We'll provide some pizza. If you're an FSF member, you're welcome to attend. There is an RSVP. We would appreciate if you would put your name on the wiki, form, wiki page that's linked to you um, from the conference website so we can get a, a good count for, a good head count there. Uh, and attending this conference gratis uh, and the free raffle ticket are just you know, two small benefits that you get. There's, there's many others besides knowing that you're uh, driving good work in the world. You can sign up at fsf.org slash join or at the registration and get your press tables. Uh, we also have lightning talks tomorrow uh, at 325. There are still some slots left, which you can sign up for on the wiki. Tonight and tomorrow night, we have some great social events. Tonight, the party is at Scholar's Bistro from 7 to 10 p.m. at Downtown Crossing near the FSF office. Uh, at the same time, at the FSF office, there is an alcohol-free uh, social and hack session. Please wear your badges to these events. Um, Scholar's is all ages until 9 p.m. Uh, both venues are accessible at Scholar's and at the office, we will provide uh, some beverages and some snacks. At Scholars, the full dinner menu is also available, as well as billiards. So I hope you'll join us there. Um, as we've done in the past, we provide IRC rooms for each IRC channels on freenode.org for each room at the conference. Uh, you can access it through your usual client, or we provide a web client at libreplanet.org slash 2019 slash live. Uh, this year, we're also providing a mumble server for, the, for voice chat um, for the first time, and that's mumble.fsf.org. So if you want to invite someone to a conversation in either of these places, we have a system that we're trying out this year. You can post a message on quitter.im using the Libra Planet hashtag that's run by GNU Social. Uh, and that will cause the message to be displayed on, the, on screens throughout the conference. Um, if you don't have a Quitter account, you can also just ask the registration desk to post a message for you, and they'll be happy to do that. We do these things because we know that not everybody can or wants to come to the United States. Um, and we are serious about the planet part of Libra Planet. So we want to enable uh, remote participation and conversations as much as possible. 
I want to thank our sponsors and exhibitors, um, especially this year, Red Hat and Private Internet Access. Their contributions enable us to uh, bring people in to speak and attend um, and help them with their travel costs and help the FSF staff be able to devote the many, many hours it requires to pull this whole thing together. Uh, we, of course, disagree with some activities of these companies, but we are very thankful um, for the support that they give us here at the event. If you can sponsor next year's event, then please do get in touch with me. We'll have a feedback survey available on the site. Uh, we'll have a feedback survey available on the site. Um, please do fill that out before you leave. We do listen to it. The alcohol-free event that we offer at the FSF office tonight came as a result of a lot of people uh, requesting that on the feedback form. And we are also growing and going to be hiring. So if you would like to join the fantastic team that helps pull this event together, uh, look for our campaigns manager opening being posted next week. Uh, and if everything goes well, uh, hopefully another one not too long after that. That will be advertised at fsf.org uh, slash jobs. So as I said, the theme for this year's event is trailblazing free software. And you know, when we talk about that theme, I, I can't imagine a better area to start the conversation off with than medical devices, um, where technology has been progressing so rapidly and raises many of the kinds of challenges that we've been concerned about um, in the free software movement. So our opening keynote this morning will be uh, Tarek Lubani, 